Hello everybody and welcome to Luxury Benefits channel. My name is Sviatoslav and in this video we will talk about ice workouts in combination with imaginations, 5 principles of working with eyes, exercises to relax the eyes and how to blink correctly. Ice workouts in combination with imaginations. You can use a lot of exercises to train your eyes by connecting a little imagination and being creative using the time and place you are in. For example, if you are in line at the office, do not waste time in weighing. Paint with your eyes the walls in front of you in a cheerful color. Mentally with your eyes paint the ceilings, wipe the windows or watch the floor. And what scope of imagination can you give while you are standing at a bus stop and waiting for transport? Look on houses, posters, on people who passes by, at all sides of the streets, remove the snow or look away on approaching cars, on the wheels. To develop your imagination, imagine that you are jumping on a tree in front of you, a squirrel with a fluffy red tail. So she jumped from the floor to the top of the tree, then jumped to another tree and instantly flew up. At the subway, while waiting on escalator, you can do imaginary paint of all the steps or walk all the railings. If you are driving, use each stop at the traffic lights for eye training, looking from the steering wheel to traffic lights and passers-by. You will usefully spend your exhausting time watching in traffic jams. Of course, you will first need to remind yourself of the needs workout in between. But then you will notice how your gaze itself starts to move. Control these movements a little and true for a short time. You will feel how the muscles of your eyes have become more functional and elastic. 5 principles of working with eyes. Vision will undoubtedly improve, but not only due to good muscle training. The point is that all visual therapy stimulates the flow of nutrients to the visual system. The eye will become healthier, more alive, brighter, sharper vision. You will look younger and healthier. And most important, after a week, pains and discomfort will completely disappear, which you may have felt at first. The eyes will become alive, mobile, will not get tired even after a stressful working day. Redness, dryness, soreness, tearing will go away. All of this will happen if several principles are observed. First one, consistency in the exercise. Second one, regularity. Third one, a gradual increase in loads. As for separate exercise and for the whole complex. Number four, taking into account individual characteristics, age, degree of disease, condition of the eye muscles, etc. And fifth, get creative approach. I will add only to the first point that consistency is understood not only alternation of exercises from all three groups in a complex, but also mandatory combining eye muscle strengthening exercise with exercise to relieve fatigue and eye strain. This will make it easier to switch from one group to another. Longer to perform the complex itself and reduce the risk overloading during training. I consider the last point the most important in this list, since only being creative will help you avoid making eye care routine and get from training not only benefit but also pleasure. Exercises to relax the eyes. I'm sure that our eyes need more rest and relaxation than exertion. Therefore, if muscle strengthening exercise need to be limited in time, then the following exercises can be done without limitation. Perform them when the very first signs of fatigue will appear. Do not retain your yawning. 
Close your eyes tightly for 3-5 seconds, then relax your eyes for the same time and again close your eyes. Straining your eyelids and muscles around eyes. Repeat 5-7 to seven times. Why should a relaxation exercise start with a strong load? The point is the random stress is required and leads to involuntary relaxation. Feel and remember a relaxation state. And notice how relaxing facial muscles when we stop frowning strongly. But as remarkably increases blood circulation in the head and eyes during time for such muscle tension. It was at this time an influx of nutrients. The ideal ending to this exercise is the urge to yawn. The fact is the muscles of the eyes are closely connected with the muscles of our face. And this interaction is especially important. Relaxing our eyes after closing our eyes. We should feel how tension flows down from the eyes, cheekbones, cheeks and jaws as it causes the need to yawn. Don't hold yourself back. The more you yawn, the faster your face and eyes will relax. If there is no desire to yawn, deliberately provoke it. Just letting go of the jaw and inhaling through the mouth. How to blink correctly? Place two fingers on the temporal lobe on your head and blink. And if you feel the muscles under your fingers move, then you are blinking incorrectly. You need to relax your eyelids and blink without tension with totally relaxed blinking movements and without any pressure. Blink easily and naturally for at least 30 seconds. Imagine that your eyelids are the wings of butterfly sitting on a flower and fluttering its bright wings. I think so that for two minutes at once it will be difficult to blink often, no matter how easy it may seem. You need to learn how to blink with ease and relaxation. Blinking process is extremely important. Firstly, the eyelids and eyelashes protect the eyes from dust, dirt and toxins. Secondly, in addition to aesthetic and protective eyelids, they have important biological function. When they blink, they wash and polish the cornea with lacrimal fluid containing antiseptic substances. The lacrimal fluid protects the eyes from drying out, bacteria, debris, essential oils, washed out if necessary with a stream of tears. The third most important property of blinking is that the seconds turn off our eyes, thus giving a short-term rest for the brain and retina. By blinking often we break the habit gaze and frozen gaze syndrome when a person look at one point for a long time, not noticing anything around him. Many experts consider frozen gaze to be one of the reasons many refractive errors. Therefore, control yourself everywhere and always in transport, in the process of reading, working at the computer and when watching TV. Be sure to blink often, easily and naturally to make it look natural. Make blinking useful a habit for your eyes, because it's necessary step of vision recovery process. Thanks for watching this video to the end, I hope it will help you. Subscribe to my channel and we'll see you again.